What's up YouTube? And Zero here and I got a third box of Phantasmal Steed Restoration. Uh, hopefully we can get more uh, um, Shadow Paladin and Pale Moon stuff because I love both those clans. Silver Thorn stuff looks really interesting so currently trying to make that. And I have janky uh, Murakumo and Dark Irregular decks in, in the process. Probably going to turn that into a variance for Dark Irregular though. So, yeah, let's get this open. Uh, advertisement. Got another uh, Dark Irregular one for Protect 2. Our little campaign pack, Volume 2. I'm definitely going to get more of the Aerial Steed Liberation, just for more of the Hollow uh, Imaginary Gift 1. Because uh, a lot of... It, I think besides Excel 2, the other Imaginary Gifts are not as popular. So, so yeah, alright. Campaign card, or can gift campaign pack. Looks like a Protect 2. And we got a regular Protect 2, which is cool. I'm cool with it. Uh, it'll go well with my Kagura deck. Alright, first pack. I'm not going to read off the card names, but I'll read off the hollows I get. Uh, we got our VR from right off the bat. Uh, Demonic Deep Phantasma Emperor, Brufus. Which is pretty cool. Definitely looks like a demon. There's no doubt about that one. Hopefully we get a second VR. That'd be nice. Uh, got a double rare, Miracle Pop Eva. Nightmare Doll Carol. That's cool. I got two of them now. I wouldn't mind a play set. We got Transient Revenger Masquerade. That's my third one. I've gotten one in each box. Every box so far. So Getting a play set won't be hard. It seems like. Frontline Revenger Claudus, which I I recently saw. I went back and watched a couple of random episodes of uh, Card Five Vanguard, and uh, Claudus was uh, Ren's starter in the Link Joker arc, I think. Yeah, Link Joker arc. Where everybody was reversed. All right, right side. We got uh, Wily Revenger Mana. That's cool. So far, it's been all Shadow Paladin and uh, Pale Moon, except for the Vanguard Rare, which is Dark Irregular. 
Oh, shit. Yes. Yes. Oh, my God. That's so freaking beautiful. Look at that. Beautiful shit. Nullity Revenger Masquerade. Fuck yes. This is a sweet SVR. Look at that. God, that... This has so far been the best box. It beats the first box, finally. Now I don't know how I'm going to top that. So not only did I got two VRs, one of them is an SVR, which is really cool. And it's a Shadow Paladin one, too, so... Always a good plus. Got Yellow Bolt. Still so happy that I got the SVR. Uh, Central Arrester. Everything seems so irrelevant now. Yeah, it, it's just downhill from that point. I don't know, maybe you get one more hollow, but it doesn't even seem like it's anything in it at this point. Yeah. Uh, Hope on Damp, which if his name didn't sound weird, I would really like this card. His name just seems so weird, but it's a really good card. You have to pull out guards in increments of 20,000, 2k shields. Uh, Silverthorn Marionette Lillian, which is a really good card, I believe. So, yeah, this is one hell of a box. This beats the first box because of that SVR. So, oh man, a little recap. We got Silverthorn, Dark Irregular, Murakumo, more Dark Irregular, the awesome SVR. Got some Shadow Pout and stuff, Nightmare Doll. So yeah, look at that. Two two VRs, one of them being an SVR, which is really cool. Not gonna lie, I'm kind of debating on trading this away to get like two uh, copies of this. Maybe three. Maybe I can squeeze three out of somebody. So yeah. So yeah, that's that's this opening. Uh, also a reminder that I'm getting or I'm waiting for Card Fight Vanguard EX to come out, come to me in the mail, because I I ordered it from Play Asia, and since the Switch is region free, I can play it, it's just I'm now waiting for the game to come. And I'm hoping it does. Because their, their shipping has, gives you like, the PlayAsia website doesn't exactly update you of when stuff's coming. So yeah, that'll be it for this video. Uh, I hope you enjoy your day and have a good one. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more. <laughs>